Hello everyone and welcome back to Sunken Land. Late last episode we got our hands on modern guns, some bulletproof armor and we found out that that was a game changer and we took out the Sea Viper outpost with ease. It was so quick to do and that's why today I want to raid more and we are starting to get a whole lot of blue flags around us right here as you can see. Uh, not much over there, but anyway, <laughs> we have raided quite a lot and today we will raid some bigger places. But first we need to figure out our ammo situation. We need to make a ammo crafting table, I think it was called. We can see if we can find it in here. Uh, it does not look like we have researched it and also we need the air filling station and maybe we should make a few more of those um, air tanks as well. Because we figured out in the last episode that the air tanks, they deplete so quickly and uh, we can hardly get the time to loot anything, especially big buildings with only one entrance and one exit. We need to be able to take our time and loot places thoroughly. Okay, here we go. We have the ammo workshop used for crafting modern ammunition. And we need 10 scrap, we have rubber, and we need 2 copper ingots. Well, we have plenty of copper ingots, so this should be no problem. Let's research. There we go. Ammo workshop. And it will cost us 10 more rubber. I think our rubber situation is uh, pretty good. Yeah, we are well stocked. Now the question is, where should we put it? Because, <laughs> oh man, it's uh, kind of full in here. Alright, I have spent a little bit of time, or <laughs> a lot of time, sorting out my inventory. I made three more wooden chests right here, where I have just uh, ore and charcoal sulfur. Then we have uh, random stuff in here, and we have craftables in here. And now we should have the room right here to put up the ammo crafting thing. The ammo workshop. There we go. Whoa, that's huge. Is it... Can we put it here and still have the duck? <laughs> There we go. I think that's good. Ah, perfect. Perfect. Let's see. We can make pistol ammo and rifle ammo and uh, everything else. Now, pistol ammo and rifle ammo is what we need. We need a whole lot of uh, copper ingots for that. I don't know how much it will give us, but uh, let's just start to, uh, you know, smelt. And also, smokeless powder. I know we have some. We should have it right up here. There we go, we have only eight. And we have black powder. I wonder, how do we make smokeless powder then? Oh man, we can actually make components? I should have figured that out a long time ago. Let's research that right away. There we go. And we can make gun parts if we need to, and that's not a priority for me right now, because we do have a lot of gun parts and we do have our guns. What we could use, though, is the Recycler. Drag unused items into it to dismantle and obtain partial raw materials, I'm guessing it should say. Oh, Jesus, we can make it right here. It's right there. You see? How much do we get if we craft one? Craft. One smokeless powder. Whoa, that's expensive. Oh, that's so expensive. Why? <laughs> <laughs> oh man, it's not gonna be easy to get ammo. Jesus Christ. Okay, let's see how much we can get if we craft uh, rifle ammo, for instance. Okay, we get uh, 10, was it? All right, let's see how much we can get for uh, pistol ammo. We have 52. Craft. And we have 67. Okay, so we get 15. 15 pistol ammo for one smokeless powder and one copper ingot okay that's okay but uh, still ammo is going to be a problem man our stats are so bad right now <laughs> okay we have 34 rifle ammo craft now we have 49 so 15 okay 15 each that's fine well guessing we have to eat and sleep please don't raid me fish Eat seafood platter. Nice. And that actually gave us uh, stamina back. Okay, so we're good. We're not tired anymore. <laughs> okay, last thing we can do today is to go down and check our uh, fish trap. And then we are going to sleep before we get raided. Red snapper and tarpoon. Because last time we got a raid at night and I don't want that. Not again. It's impossible to see them. And that reminds me, we need to do something about our uh, light situation. Maybe we can get a flashlight or helmet light or weapon light, maybe? 
Anyway, I'm going to sleep right now and uh, tomorrow, first thing, we will sort out our inventory and then we are going out raiding. Alright, we have slept. It is still partially nighttime, but... Hello. What's with this line right here? That's weird. I don't like that. But anyway, we can sort out our inventory now. Alright, our inventory is all sorted out. We are full up on health, on stamina, food and water. And we are ready to go. But where should we go? We do have an island right there. And we did have that island with cars on land, you know? Oh, our inventory is not sorted. Okay. Alright, now it's sorted. Now where should we go? Was it that island we were at last time? Mutant settlement, unknown ruins, radio island. Alright, we are uh, quickly going into daytime right here, so let's just find an island and uh, raid. Should we do this one? This one? Or that one back there? This one is the closest to us, and we do have the refinery over there, which we also want to loot, right? So let's do this island first, and then we can go over to the uh, refinery if we have any more inventory space, and finish looting over there. Alright, here we are. We have marauders over here. This is the uh, island with the bus or the train on it. And I'm going to use the same tactics as before. We are going to circle around and try to shoot them from the boat before we go in, because, man, this place is a fort. Oh, there we go. Hello. Nice. One down. Probably several more to go. <laughs> oh, hello. Am I spotted? Now, there was one guy out on the rocks right there. I don't know where he went. There's one. Oh, here we go. <laughs> hello, swimmer. Let's see. Let's use the crossbow on this guy. There we go. Nice. Do you have any loot? Oh, nice. Take it. I don't think we are able to take out anyone else from uh, out here because this place is a fortress. So I think we have to try and go inside. Oh, okay. This might be the death of us. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, boy. Oh, crashing. I see ya. Have you seen me? Reload. Anyone else in here? One up there. Can't shoot through these uh, fences or roof or whatever. God damn, okay. Right, that's one. I see you. I see you. There are probably a lot more, right? Oh! Shit. Uh oh. Shit. Man, you guys can shoot. Holy crap. All right, run and gun. Okay. Oh, all right. This is exciting. And we are doing good, actually. Now, who's up here? Probably one in there. And up there as well, yeah? Nice. No one else in here? Up top? No? Okay, we have a good vantage point right here. There's one. Is he coming down? Oh, hello. Whoa! That's it? Seems like that's it. Nice. We didn't take that much damage. Our armor is a little bit uh, shot up, but uh, we can easily fix that. Anyone in here? No? Oh, all right. Nice. I'm happy about this. All right, let's loot up. Not much ammo in there, sadly. Okay. 
chemical substance, though. That's nice. That means that we can make more ammo. Not much, but a little bit. Uh, that's it for in here. We got a chest right there. All right, four components. That's nice. Oh, yeah. Guns are definitely a game changer. This was fun. Nice. Ooh. Nice. I'll eat and I'll drink. Okay, not bad. I'll drop the strawberry seeds. We don't need those. And what's up with this uh, train thing right here? Is it possible or bus? Is it possible to go inside? Ooh. We have boxes. No loot. Is this not loot? Oh, that's sad. I was hoping that uh, there was something inside here. All right, we do have a little bit left, but I need to go and uh, drop off in our inventory before I loot anymore. Not much left to loot here. Just a little bit of scrap and trash. Whoa, do you guys have a basement? That's cool. Oh, there's a safe. Oh, that's nice. More to this place than meets the eye. Here we go. Broken hunting rifle. And some high-end perfume and blueprint. Reinforced structures. Oh, hidden crate. Nice, just some gun parts. That's fine. We don't actually need that, but it's good to have anyway. Oh, didn't see this. Well, it doesn't seem like there is any more hidden loot right here. I think we have depleted the entire compound. But before we forget, let's put up the flag. This looks like a nice place to uh, put a flag. Let go. And change to blue. Oh boy. Oh boy. We are crashing inside the rock. That's bad. Now that was a fun raid and it took us almost the whole day, so let's get back home and sort out our inventory. Home sweet home, and we have new trees. That's very nice, because we are out of wood. As always. Hello, crab. Do I have room? No. I do not. I'll just leave you there and uh, I'll pick you up later. And let's repair. Nice. Now we have just one problem. Our inventory is completely full. So what I'm going to do is uh, go over to the trader, take with me what I can, see what I can sell, and see what I can buy, or barter, that is. Hello. You look kind of lost. I'm not. Let's see, she does not have ammo, but she has electronic parts, chemical substance, and ballistic fiber. All of which we need. So, uh... I want everything. I could use another battery. Get lost. Get lost. <laughs> Get lost. Come on. Come on, how much do you want for this? I managed to uh, get uh, the 10 chemical substances and the 4 electronic parts for this. I just kept removing things and uh, just to see how low she wanted to go. Let's deal. Now how much do you want for this? Dude. Not enough. Is ballistic fiber that expensive? That's sick. How about a battery? Alright, I think that's enough. I will uh, go back and uh, go to bed and I will see all of you in the morning. And we have morning. Welcome back everyone. As you can see, I did not park my boat right there. It's right out here because I wanted to get up to bed before they got a chance to raid us again. Because night raids... Man, we don't like that, because we can't see. And we are being raided. From where? There we go. Whoa, okay, we got guns. Ow! Whoa, it's a war zone. Where are you? Oh, hello. Stand still. Whoa! 
Whoa. They must be uh, angry at me for uh, looting their base. <laughs> What's happening? Come on, show yourself. Come on. There we go, man. Okay. That was one hell of a raid. I hope you have good loot. Nope. 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 Uh, nope. No. And there's the last one. No. I don't use that primitive ammo. Alright, our wood situation is a little bit better now than it was before. And I have nothing to go in here. We can drop those seeds. Alright, before we do anything today, we need to sort our inventory because we can't go out looting while our inventory is full up like it is. We are actually doing really good on resources right now, so I think I want to spend the day at our base and I want to research a little bit of what we need. I want to try and build up the fortifications a little bit more and try to upgrade the structures that we have because we are being raided by stronger and stronger enemies. These guys were full on packing guns, you know? So the first thing I want to do is to research recycler. All right, what do we need to build the recycler? Five electronic parts and five components, plus 15 scrap metal. Oh yeah, we need the air filling station as well. Let's build that too. All right, let's try to build the recycler. How big is it? Not that big. You can actually put it right here. That's a nice place for it. And the air filling station. We can also put that right here. I don't want it inside, I think. That's nice, right? That works. Install wire. One rubber. Decompose item. Why do we have to install a wire? What if we put the bucket in here? Install wire. Connect. Return. Ah, uh, okay. That means that we need to research the generator. This consumes fuel. How much? And does it consume all the time? Alright, we need to make up some components then. Takes rubber, but luckily I think we have a lot of rubber. Yeah. That's fine. Make a few more. And we need iron ingots, oh, of course. Now, we have the air tank. Place air tank. And roll to operate. Alright, that's it. Nice. Alright, that works. At least it doesn't take electricity to operate. Alright, I have repaired this. But I don't think we are able to upgrade it. If I take the metal foundation, I can put it on the outside, but I can't put it here. But I think it takes a while for them to actually destroy the wooden foundations. Whoa, okay, this is bad. Oh, whoa, okay, it would be really bad if this one fell down. There we go, everything is repaired. Let's take some wood. I just want to show you my thinking when it comes to fortification. So if we make wooden pillars right here. There we go. And we can take some, let's see, metal wall with window there and there. And we take a metal floor right there. Ooh, we can extend it more. I don't want to do that. I don't think so. Let's build a staircase. See if we can place it perfectly. Right about there, right? And then, since they are coming in from here often, and also here, we can stand up here and shoot. And if we then make some uh, fortifications, like a barricade, simple wooden cover that can be crouched behind for shooting, right? That makes sense, I think. Right there. Okay, maybe not. <laughs> well, we'll try it out. We'll try it out. There we go. Now we have some fortification right here. And we can shoot from here. And as we have seen, they cannot get up here, it seems. They don't know how to jump. So that is a little bit of my thinking. And I want to do the same thing right here. 
There we go. I don't know why I'm using uh, wooden pillars and metal flooring and walls. I don't know. It, it just looks good, I think. And I want to put a, another staircase in here. Preferably the same angle as the other one. That good? Oh no. That's better. Looks kind of wonky, but uh, we can have this as an entrance entrance point. And uh, we can shoot from here, I think. Still have a lot of scrap. We are about to die, but let's finish this first. Like so. Nice. So if they come from there, of course, we don't want to stand here like a target. But if they come from here, we can stand here and shoot. Even though it's not that easy to see over these. Oh, that's bad. That's a little bit bad. Because you are supposed to be able to crouch down behind these and shoot, but uh, we can't see over that well. But it looks a little bit better, and we should put some um, fireballs underneath each, maybe up top. Like we have done here, so we have some more lighting and heat. And we need to go and eat and drink before we die. And we should have slept a long time ago. And it's 11 o'clock. We are far into the day already. And right now I still want this open because they are still coming in from here and going around here. And we can't shoot them from this point, you know. We could make a tower over on the rocks right there. That could be a possibility. Other than that, I think we are safe up here. Yeah. Okay, we have depleted most of our wood, but we are full almost. And I'm just going to put things into storage again, and we need to get out and loot. I want to do the school, and I want to finish the refinery. All right, let's get going before we get raided again. It seems to happen more and more often, so uh, I want to get out there as fast as possible, and our inventory should be fine. And I think the inventory on the boat is fine as well. Yeah, and we have two full batteries. All right, the school should be over this way. I don't actually know where the refinery is. Where was it? I can't find it on my map for some reason. We do have some weird glitches today. Oh, is it because I still have the hammer? I don't have the hammer. Put it away. <laughs> there we go. Oh, there's the refinery all the way out there. Okay, sail up. We don't need the crossbow. We don't need the crossbow bolts. And we should be good with one battery, I think. We don't need the binoculars. I'll bring the ammo. I'm not sure if the guns work underwater. Let's find out. No, it does not. Get the spear. There should be a shark. Or several sharks. Here we go. One shark at least. Yeah. Ow. Yeah. Yeah. All right, then. Let's keep checking the outside. I want to save my air tank for when we are going into the school, because that's a large building with a lot of things to loot and only one way in and out. Do we have any ore in this place? We should have sulfur, right? We do have some sulfur right here. Red algae and scallops. Nice. I'll take the scallops. I'll leave the sulfur, though. It only takes up room and I haven't found a good use for it yet. Toilet. <laughs> That's weird. Alright, I have been around the entire school at this point, and I'm gonna leave all the loot in here. That I can fit in here, that is. Oh, we are already full up so much scrap. And now I am going to equip the air tank. And before it gets dark, we need to get through the school. And I've been very economic with the use of my uh, underwater scooter right here, so that we have a lot of battery as well. All right, let's do this. Now I am only taking searchables. I am not going to take everything else because we do not have the time and we do not have the space for all the resources. And you see my air tank? Damn, nice. Chemical substance. Good, that's it for in here. Time to get upstairs. Medicine cabinet. Let's use the diving time increase. All right, we need to go. Man, it's getting late and dark fast. I'm gonna take one more crack at this place before it gets uh, really dark. I am going to see if I can get to the top. We are not going to be able to finish this place today, but hopefully the top is where the good loot is. Uh, no, 
Oh, we got another chest. Same as the other one. Oh, safe. Come on, come on, come on. Eh, that's bad. We are freezing. We need to go. Whew. There we go, man. That took a long time. And I see now that we should probably have multiple air tanks. Because this does not work. And we are freezing. Dude, we are freezing fast. We need to get home. Oh, look at that beautiful night sky. And the moon lights up the place. That's nice. Oh, yeah. Home sweet home. Into the warmth. What's wrong with our boat? What the hell is happening to our boat? We need to get down there. It's full of loot. If it gets destroyed, man. That's a waste. Oh, okay. Our boat is stuck. <laughs> oh no. Let's uh, leave some scrap. Take the most important things out of the boat. Okay. Okay. This is bad. This is bad. This is so bad. <laughs> oh, I didn't expect that. <laughs> oh man. We sank our boat. Well, that's a fitting ending to this episode. We sank our boat. <laughs> we didn't do everything we set out to do today, but we did get to raid a rather large compound of marauders with our guns, and we did it quite easily, I must say. And we did manage to take most of the school, but we still have a lot of rooms left. We see now that we are probably in need of multiple air tanks so we can switch between while we are looting through a large building like that. So in the next episode we are going to get uh, more air tanks, we are going to loot the school, we are going to finish the refinery, and also we are going to find another large place to raid. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode, thank you so much for watching, and as always, I will see you all in the next one. Bye bye! <laughs>